In time, back here in St. Louis, the Broadway sensation Wicked playing right now at the fabulous Fox Theater. Of course, it tells the story about what happened in the land of Oz before Dorothy showed up. True story. Mm, it's a true story. Our Paige Halsey is learning about the story behind the story as she joins us live at the Fox. Paige? That's right, one of the most popular productions ever. And today we are joined by two of the stars of the show. We have Lisa de Guzman, who plays Elphaba, and we also have Jennifer Newberry, who plays Glenda. And ladies, we have to start with the elephant in the room, the green elephant in the room, <laughs> and that's your ear, your green ear. You're still green from all of that makeup. How do you do that night after night? Well, it just sort of becomes part of the routine, and it's actually pretty relaxing because for the first, you know, I get to the theater, and for the first 15, 20 minutes, we, I sit with my makeup artist, and we catch up, and she paints me, and it's just part of the part of the pre-show ritual. But you have it down to a science. You can fully get into costume in just seven minutes. Is that right? Yes, the makeup artist is actually trained to put the makeup on me in seven minutes. I mean, I can't get ready for date night that fast. So that is <laughs> impressive. Okay, Jennifer, I want to ask, did you ever think, hmm, maybe we should switch roles? I would love to be green day after day. Uh, yes, I mean, <laughs> we, we do talk about it often um, because it would just be wild. Um, but um, yeah, when I was growing up, I who didn't sit in the car and belt defying gravity? Um, but I think Lissa is really suited to do it more than I am. <laughs> and you have the fabulous, beautiful dress, so I think it all works out. I want to talk a little bit about what it's like life on the road. It's really fun. It's, it's a really good way to see the country. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't go to all these cities if it weren't for this tour and I get to eat the local food and, and you know, meet the local people and go to the you know, art museums and the parks. So it's a really cool way to know the cities really well. We're watching um, some scenes from the production. You both have been with Wicked on tour for more than a year. How do you find new energy to do the same show night after night? Oh my goodness. Um, we just both try to stay super grounded and just be with each other and um, respond to what the other is giving. We have an incredible cast uh, surrounding us that sometimes there will be different people on stage and, and that brings a different energy. And of course the fabulous audiences also affect that as well. Um, so it's just different in every city and it's different every day because we're different every day. So. I love that. And we are going to get to find out, the city of St. Louis is going to find out very soon if Glinda is any good at sports. What do you have planned while you're in St. Louis? Oh my goodness. Um, I am going to, on Monday night, I get to throw the ceremonial first pitch at the Cardinals game. So <laughs> my dad has told me to warm up my arm and I'm going to do my best to make Wicked proud. <laughs> what do you think? Can she do it? Is she going to throw from the mound? She's not going to throw to the mound, <laughs> but I believe in her. <laughs> I love your honesty. And you guys, you can see like the friendship between these ladies behind the scenes. And you can see how that just translate on stage to a great show. Ladies, thank you so much for being here with us this morning and enjoy your stay in St. Louis. Thank you. Thanks thank for you having so us. And you can see Wicked here at the Fabulous Fox now through May 7th. If you want more information, of course, you can visit the website fabulousfox.com. You can also buy tickets at Metro Tix or call 314-534-1111. We are live from the Fabulous yeah. Fox. Paige Holsey, send it back you. to you guys. Thank you so much, Paige. I've, I've been down on the mound for that first pitch, and it's kind of nerve-wracking. It really just is. Just thinking of Chip Carey saying, and the mound just got a little taller as Glinda <laughs> has thrown up just in advance of the ceremonial first pitch. Thank you, ladies. We appreciate it.